This isn't right. Should have reached the river by now. If I change so much that my old memories are throwing me off. Yeah, that's more like it. It started raining right after we crossed it last time. Kind of what an ordeal that was. Because of the crappy weather, we had a major dispute about whether to retrieve the rope or save the rifle for something else. This time, we can just zip on over and get the rope back before the weather turns. And if I and Mina can make two round trips, we can avoid some senseless conflict. We should just cross right over. Right, so let's get a move on. And the girl moves fast. In terms of pure strength, I'm pretty sure I could go toe to toe with her in my current condition. She's got a sense of balance I can't even come close to competing with. The girl really is just naturally gifted, I guess. Huh? What the? Those are some nasty looking clouds. Uh oh. What? Why? Oh, uh, nothing. Oh, yeah. It rained the day I got bitten, too, when I was all laid up. I see. So that's what this is. Oh, shit. How could I forget about this storm? That was dumb. You say that again, Chief. Hmm, something up, Maya? Huh? Yeah, that's that's uh ho ho. I kinda f I, I even I kinda uh forgot that that might uh, come into play, huh? Imagining things. Okay guys, I'll cross over first. Everyone's like, oh no, rain. You're like, well, better get across, guys. It's even higher than it was when we crossed, and the rapids are much fiercer. Not to mention, it isn't big enough to shield us all from the rain. It'll only be a matter of time before everyone's soaking wet. I totally abandoned the rope. No. Makes sense. The sheer force of the impact will probably blow away the entire tree. She wants Tama to aim for the knot just to be safe. Yes, yes, they are. Large factuals. I don't know what this conversation before, ladies. Uh oh, it's turning the same exact argument as last time. It's the same thing she said last time, but this really gets me. Yeah, so I didn't see that one coming. I feel like I remember this exact same back and forth. Oh, really? So basically, you don't give a shit. I shouldn't be surprised she's being so noncommittal. Alright, well I've been thinking. In about three or four hours the rain should stop. If we wait until then we can get the rope back without having to sacrifice the rifle. But I'm the only one who knows that future for certain. 
I totally get that everybody's super anti and wants to get to the girl ASAP. The hard truth is that it'd be best if we had both the rifle and the rope on hand. Right, uh... No, 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 no. They're gonna get way too suspicious if we wait for the water. They're already mad suspicious of us. Save the bullet. We'll just go about this like how we did last time. There are plenty of other things we can substitute for a rope. No matter how much the rain might drown out the sound, it's probably not a good idea to risk alerting the enemy with a gunshot at this point. But in Thomas' hands, the rifle is bound to prove useful later on. Specifically, we're going to need it to shut down that gun battery. Oh, hang on a second. I know I'm the one who suggested it, but you sure you don't want to argue this some more? Hmm. Okay then, who do you want to carry the rifle? Yeah, every single second counts here. You gotta get a move on. Hmm. Oh, I just... Right, can't just stand here looking super angsty. Concentration is key right now. That's the thing, like, we only had one of the items the first time around and we barely made it, but now we got, like, a head start on it. So... Just saying. Last time we came under fire just as we finally reached the evac point. The unexpected bombardment drove our helicopter away. Shit. <laughs> Accidentally, uh, skip something. It was incredibly discouraging for everyone to have our victory snatched away like that at the last possible moment. But this time... Of course he said that out loud. Can we take out the gun battery's radome with the rifle before we head over there? Actually no, that'd probably be a bad idea. If we destroy it before we even reach the evac point, Yuko Sensei's plan would be completely ruined. This is Sensei we're talking about, so she probably never planned on letting us escape from point D in the first place. Probably not a good idea to try to change our actual destination. Ugh. I guess I've got no choice but to let them take pot shots at us again. Ah, yeah, it's nothing. I'm just a little exhausted, that's all. Yeah, I know. Crap, was that obvious? Really need to get my act together. Sheesh, you guys are ice cold. Really just ditch your own squad mate like that. That's kind of point. Yeah, yeah, I hear ya. God, everyone just looks so happy. I feel kind of sorry for them, considering they failed last time. This must feel twice as exciting. Now since it's going to tear this victory right out of their grasp. I can't exactly tell them it's too soon to be celebrating. Wait, no. Hold on a sec. Let me do it. I always wanted to try this. Actually, it does matter. Once we start waving those smoke candles around, the gun battery will open fire. They go in not knowing that, they could get blown to bits. I want to do it out on the edge. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, whatever, dude. It was a total fluke that I survived last time, but this time I've got to take the necessary precautions. Oh, here it goes. I think the artillery fire came from that direction. Can plan my great escape. Chopper's here, so it won't be much longer until. There it is. Trying. I noticed. This didn't catch me by surprise this time. No way in hell I'm gonna get hit by that thing. Get it, shit. Ah. Okay, so that did go better than last time, but I still almost bit the big one. My heart feels like it's gonna explode. Yeah, 
Well, it certainly is. Heli, Nigetetta. Ushio. Mada Ningu Tasesta Kotoni and Arano de Arona. Amakata de Wakene. Hi, Kotira Nima Nana Bibuntai. Ah, Mina Nikter. Tiny song I already said. Yeah, just a small change of plans. Oh yeah, just a teensy change? Ugh, whatever. Imagine that. Oh, we've noticed, and you're the one who activated it. Any simpleton can figure that one out. よかい。新たな脱出ポイントの位置点は攻撃をしている砲台を真後ろね。いや。そこに行くまでに砲撃される可能性がありますが、私はできるのは脱出ポイントを教えることだけよ。以上。She そうもって演習に臨んでいたからな。Good。そなたこそ先ほどより顔色が良いぞ。銃撃で結構が良くなったと見える。Oh, <laughs> give me a break. I just t was just ten steps because things were going a little too well. I was waiting for the other shoe to drop, you know. さすがだな。それにしてもいかにも博士らしいやり方だよね。Yeah, uh -huh. I think so too. Go Sensei's a real piece of work, ain't she? Hang on a sec. This is where I dropped my canteen last time, isn't it? Then I found that boat when I went to go pick it up again. I really should have brought that fuel along, even if it would have meant sacrificing a whole canteen of water. Totally forgot we were going to be hit by two squalls. Well, shit. Guess we're just going to have to walk. It shouldn't be too much fur further before we spot that radome. It'd be great if Tama could notice it first, but I kind of doubt that'll happen. Maybe it's just like casually pointed out to her or something. Boy, that ocean sure is beautiful. Hey, I'm not just sightseeing here. I'm keeping an eye out for any potential seaborne assailants, dude. Hey, I know. Tama, can you see anything out there? I mean, you've got the best eyes out of all of us. Yeah, that wasn't suspicious at all. Yes, bingo, baby. What's up, Tama? You see something out there? Um, mm hmm. Who would have seen that coming, huh? Perfect, they're getting it. Sweet, now that's all left is for them to realize that's the gun battery sensor. See anything? Yes. Go on. Which means that's probably the only sensor in the area. I actually know for a fact that's the only radome, but I can't exactly explain that to these guys. Sakaki,レドームを破壊しよう。砲台のセンサーである可能性が高い以上、やるべきだ。そうね。玉は一発しかないし、アンチマテリアルライフルじゃ砲台は破壊できないものね。ここで使わない手はないわ。玉せ、狙撃準備。でもここから撃つの？かなり距離あるよ。At this point, Thomas still isn't completely conquered her performance anxiety. Oh, she actually gonna miss this time though. Now that I'm aware of that, I'm noticing subtle changes in her expression that I never picked up on before. I'm actually brimming with confidence here. Counting on you. You're the one who took down that shuttle as it came plunging toward us from beyond the horizon. I know you can do this. 
レドームの上を狙ってあのタイプはそこに索敵レーダーが入ってるはずだからうんそうねさっきの砲撃で私たちの位置が把握された可能性もあるしねタイムズゴイプロン Most I can do for her now is try to keep the others from distracting her. But it's up to you, Tama. It's time for shot. <laughs> Top of the radome blew off. <laughs> Hell yeah. Heck yeah. Hell yeah. Kore de Hodai wa kini sezu ni susumu koto ga dekiru kano se ga takamata wa kene. Shikashi, kakushou ga nai ijo. Yeah, surprises. Couldn't agree more. Okay, that's one big obstacle out of the way. Moving on. Day five. Perfect. We're we're gonna make we're gonna make it with plenty of time. Yeah, thanks for keeping watch. <laughs> Holy smokes, I did not remember the bridge being this bad. If we tried crossing it the way it is right now, we'd drop like a ton of bricks. From this height, it sure wouldn't be pretty. You can see the arch from here. There's no doubt it's more stable than this thing. If it were just a question of crossing, I'd totally go with the safe choice, but... Yes. I guess we do have some time to spare right now. If we want to make it absolutely sure all of us make it, we should take the long way. But going along the coastline isn't exactly a walk in the park. There are probably traps in the jungle. It'd definitely take a while to get to the metal bridge. If we want to prioritize speed, we're going to need to make it across this shoddy little death trap. Since we don't have any way of repairing this bridge, we're going to have to take the long way along the cliffs. Mm-hmm. Oh, tell me about it. God damn it. Well, at the very least, we can all be glad the turret's been taken out. Let's get going. No time, let's move out. Wait, Takeru. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. I'm not rushing, I just want to get a move on, okay? There's no telling what we've got ahead of us. Yeah, but just passing isn't good enough. If we take six days to do this, then nothing's changed. Gotta make sure we finish this thing today, no matter what. I think we should leave some time for securing the evac point. Understood. Yeah, I'm coming up with some bullshit excuse every now and then. Don't worry about it. This is eating up all the time it saved. We're only one day ahead of schedule now. I was hoping we could save at least two. Yeah, well, if we would have saved at least two, then they'd be mad suspicious of us, and that's not what we were trying to do here. Damn it, I really underestimated how hard it would be to change the future. I need to step, my, step up my game before it's too late. Where's the helicopter? But, but it should be right around here, shouldn't it? And we just shot off a signal flare too. Uh-oh. There's nothing here. Where the hell is it? Where's the damn chopper? Huh? Where's the chopper? Where did she even come from? It's finally over. I'm so exhausted. Huh? Wait a minute. I mean, we don't pass just by getting here? Oh, Alright. I 
かせ。あ。白金と鎧は基地襲撃を日中に行ったな。なぜセオリーである夜明け前を選ばなかった。あ。それは。Because we felt it would be dangerous to move through the jungle before first light without having a secured escape route. Shoe in the chicken, you need to be cockney sticker, Yakan, you get to the bottom of the dictum. Crap. Did I rush things too much? Take his set, oh, guys, to the bottom of the dictum. So stay, rope, oh, guys, you stay in I know, oh, you can get ten zyder. Three get you, but I need you, oh, sorry, you can go out of Bakarika. Taking Corella no gain ten, oh, guess. That, that only matters if we're fighting humans. It's the beta we're fighting here, isn't it? Mada Machan. <clears throat> oh crap. Of all the times. For me to slip up. What? What does she mean by that? Omedeto. Samara wa kono hyoka eishu o pasu shita. Demo. Sore dake no jyudai no misu. Sakaki. この演習の第一優先目的は何だ脱出、です実戦において計画通り事態が推移することは稀だそれゆえ、タイミングや運といった要素も重要になるそれらすべてを味方につけ、結果として目的を達成すればそれが正しい判断だったということになるんだ I'll take it セオリーはセオリーでしかない結果として貴様らを狙える位置に追撃部隊は存在しなかった砲台のセンサーは一つだけだったそして貴様らは全員脱出に成功した違うかいえ<笑>榊<笑> Yeah, it was gonna be all emotional that the characters were like, yeah, now guys, we did it, that's great, that's great, we need to get back to space now これで戦術機だね一歩前進 Yeah, that's for damn sure God, what was up with that? She almost gave me a heart attack. Yeah, thanks to all of you. Yeah. Yeah, and he's disappointed because it wasn't early enough. Sorry, I am happy. I promise. I'm just a little tuckered out is all. I really can't manage to pretend I'm thrilled about this. I should have passed away sooner. Yet, if we'd made one little slip up earlier today, we wouldn't have finished until tomorrow. I managed to shorten our time by a little bit, but it hardly even makes a difference. <sighs> well, there's no point in raining on everyone's parade here. If nothing else, we've overcome one of the major hurdles. Let's just try to be happy about that for now. Well, everyone else is doing just fine with that. Okay, so that's episode 3 done. It's episode 4. What's next? Did you not remember your swimsuit? What the fuck, dude? I've still got to find a souvenir for Kasumi. What should I get her? To be completely honest, I don't have the slightest clue what a girl might like. Especially not a girl as weird as Kasumi. Oh, maybe the seashell would work. Put it to your ear and it's almost like you can hear the ocean. It's a perfect gift. Well, it's kind of a one-trick pony, admittedly. Well, anyway, that settles it. He doesn't even care about all the girls in swim, so he's like, Listen, I gotta bring back a gift for my homie. I told my homie I'd bring gifts. I gotta bring gifts. And you know what? I expect that. Delicious.